Hello and welcome to my review of Big Boss Malayalam. This is the first video that I'm posting about what is happening in the Big Boss house in Malayalam version. Uh, this was kind of a shocking week. We saw a lot of things happening in Big Boss house. First of all, the shocking nomination. Uh, you know, Shweta Menon and Ranjini Haridas were the nominated contestants. Now, first of all, this itself probably would be the first time i'm not very sure i may have to check but this has never happened before that in big boss house especially in such early weeks only two contestants are nominated for eviction how did this happen i have no idea whether this was a planned move to get a particular contestant out of the house could be maybe not but i feel that yes it could be and i'll talk about it later on i'll definitely talk about why i feel so that this could have been a strategy from Big Boss. Okay, so Shweta Menon and Ranjini Haridas were the nominated contestants and the entire house had conspired to get them out or rather to be nominated. Okay, so Shweta Menon gets 10 votes and Ranjini Haridas gets 8 votes. Now mind you, these two are the strongest players in the house. Now things why I feel that uh, this was a strategy by Big Boss team to have only two contestants nominated for eviction. First of all, it was very clear that when it comes up for nomination, most of the housemates or rather all the housemates are going to vote for these two contestants only. Ranjini because she is very strong. She expresses herself very strongly or rather shall I say loudly and she's an excellent player she's a threat to all and maybe her um, the boldness or her bold attitude may not go well with many others in the house shweta menon she's a um, what to say the most popular celebrity in the house i would say she's got a, she, uh, her resume is excellent she's acted in hindi malayalam i mean so many movies she's got a a vast experience behind a very popular figure and uh, therefore definitely a threat now there were a few things that didn't work for them first let's talk about shweta menon rather i feel that this whole exercise was to get shweta menon out of the house shweta menon no doubt is an amazing actress i am personally very fond of her movies and her uh, talent and all that and when she came into the Big Boss house as a first contestant, I was truly, truly, you know, happy to see her. But somewhere down the line, what I felt was she's carrying her celebrity tag too seriously. She's, she's carrying her seniority too seriously. She definitely has got that um, complex that she is a senior and she definitely, therefore, deserves that kind of respect. And... Okay, she deserved, she definitely does deserve, but she was demanding it. That is what I felt. So she had that attitude. She had made that statement once to Bashir that you're too small to be talking to me, something to that effect. That was not, you know, the right thing to say because in the Big Boss house, all contestants are equal. Your personal achievements, your personal success or what you have achieved in your career, in your personal life, you leave it out along with all the other gadgets and personal stuff that you have to leave outside the Big Boss house. Inside, all are equal. So this is one thing that Shweta Menon forget, forgot and that probably went against her. Second thing was, you know, that, uh, this, you know, that incident with um, Anoop, uh, yes, she was definitely hurt. Yes, Anup was wrong in making statements about her. She was definitely hurt. But she, you know, the fact that she comes out and tells the story that she told, what Big Boss told her and that Big Boss showed her the clipping, that lie was caught. And uh, during the weekend episode with Mohan Lal, he played that video. Okay, so nothing was shown to her. And that was, a, you know, a piece of lie that she had told to the other fellow contestants that went wrong with her and for the audience the guy uh, you know the viewer profile of uh, big boss malayalam i'm sure this will not go down well because maybe in some other versions this you know the viewers would be much more mature 
to understand that this is a strategy but this is the first week of big Bo sorry first season of big boss malayalam and the viewers are still uh, coming to terms with this show and trying to understand the format and everything so then that also played against her so she was labeled as a liar that was again something that went against her she carried that attitude of i am the biggest celebrity in the house which went against her so i guess these were the things that you know um, probably the big boss malayalam viewers could not uh, accept or digest from someone like shweta menon and before any more damage could be done to her image it's better to get her out of the house hence only two nominations trust me if there were a third contestant nominated for eviction it would have been that person because definitely uh, shweta menon and ranjini haridas carry a much more bigger fan base than anyone else in the house now what uh, other things that happen in the house pearly my god i don't know where this woman comes from she has changed her um, image so much in these few weeks in the house constantly she's singing you know when she first entered she was that kind of meek soft docile i don't know i'm lost i'm this simple girl i'm this homely girl nan ingane thaniya nan veetu ingane thaniya and that was something that you know everybody were find confused is this the same pearly money that people know of you know outside you know the kind of uh, image that she projects as this young dynamic bold girl and here she was all this pooch wala should i say that no i don't know whatever she was trying to be very meek and then suddenly she changes colors and there were lot of things spoken about her her equation with shrinish it's a personal life both are single they can do whatever they want but again you know there are lot of moral pundits in the house who found that uh kind of uh, disturbing or annoying or in whatever um, that's again something to do. maybe it's a strategy whatever but it's working good for both shrinish and pearly because they are getting that much um footage i would say uh, for the show her equation with uh, aristo suresh and or rather i should say the other way around aristo suresh blind Uh, worship of pearly money whatever pearly says is right whatever pearly does is right uh, anybody says anything against pearly then automatically they become his enemy so that was a kind of thing that is happening uh, for aristo suresh it doesn't go well this is not the right thing to do um, so th definitely you know those were the things that were happening sabu becomes captain of the house and that was a very interesting task where uh, the three contenders for captainship sabu anup and dia they had to pedal the cycle for a very long time and they did not know for whom they are pedaling because the photos that were kept against each of the cycle were covered and only at the end of it one realized that sabu was the first one to get up the cycle and that had a picture of dia anup was the next it had his own picture and obviously dia cycle had anup uh, sorry sabu's picture and hence he becomes a captain now sabu is playing it very smart i don't know whether he's seen all the seasons of big boss in hindi and other languages but he is a smart player he is one to look out for in this house currently the people whom i feel are really playing the game well who have understood the game well are ranjini archana to some extent pearly and sabu and of course sabu leads the pack over here it will be interesting to see who gets nominated because obviously um uh, you know the people um, are uh, right now uh, harboring negative thoughts about pearly and aristo suresh so it would be interesting to see how the nomination takes place for the next week uh, shweta menon is out of the house there is a new entrant in the house the again a wild card entry has come after shias Uh, i don't know whether there would be any value addition because she has has not made any he came with a lot of attitude and it just fizzled out after his first encounter with pearly where she said nyan ninne whatsapp la block cheyidirnu that was one awesome statement again coming from pearly she is giving a lot of content for the show no one can deny that ranjini is giving a lot of content for the show no one can deny that 
by her deeds gesture and above all her volume so let's see what happens it's interesting people are slowly uh, coming to terms with big boss malayalam the contestants have just begun to understand the game archana is a brilliant player uh, she has realized her mistake you know the week earlier we saw that uh, you know she was very negative about ranjini and shweta and she thought that they are conspiring to get you know her friends out of the house now she is realized that that's not the the case because both shweta and ranjini do not need to conspire against anyone it's enough what they do for themselves that is what is going to keep them in the game or keep them out as we saw shweta is out of the house because of what she did and what went against her uh, so archana is now um, she's realized that she was wrong in judging Uh, ranjini and shweta and since shweta is out of the house i guess this week we will see uh, archana bonding with ranjini more than with anyone else she is deeply hurt with her own uh, bestie dia sana dia sana is another player that you know who keeps changing colors like a chameleon let's see what next week have in us um, keep liking keep sharing and do not fail to subscribe thank you so much